in the fourth gear. Oh, oh, no, 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 oh. What is going on guys, Roadmaster, and today we're doing a top speed build on, on the 2011 Hot Wheels Rat Rod. I forgot what it's called, I'll have to check back in the title, but you guys know what it is from the title. Yeah, this thing is awesome, it came out in the Hot Wheels DLC today, yeah, today, today's Tuesday, today, and this thing, look at that grill, that is amazing. A giant skull with hands around it. The back is just. This is a proper rat rod, not the um, the Plymouth Prowler that people were calling a hot rod or something. This is a proper rat rod. So, yeah, let's go see what this thing can do on the track. Alright, guys, we are back, and let's hear how this thing sounds. It's got to sound monstrous. It sounds so cool. The exhaust on the—it's gotta have a V8 in it. Like, what rat rod does not have a V8 in it? It's got to. The flames, the skulls, no roof. Look at how high the shift lever is. <laughs> that is awesome. Top speed—I really have no idea. So let's go into your review. And in three, two, one, go. Wait a minute. Wait, let's make sure we have traction off. Because this thing should not have traction control on. There we go, off. Alright, three, two, one, go. Come on. It's really. It likes to wheel spin a lot. That bet you this would be good for drifting. It probably would be. Yeah, look how much we're spinning. It's only got three gears. Uh oh. Alright, come on, there's 140. And that shift lever, though, that's so cool with the spine going down it. There's 148. Come on, 150. 150, there we go. 151. Hey, come on, it's going, it's still going more. Well, no, it's not, forget it, it's not. Alright, I'm gonna stop. Alright, wow, 150. Uh, I guess I did kinda expected it. I, I, don't, I don't know what to expect from rat rods. So, let's go back, upgrade it, and make this thing more of a drift car. Alright, guys, we are back. And a quick upgrade. It says S Class. Wow. All right, let's get to our class then. Uh, let's go conversions, uh, only drive train. All wheel drive, no, we're gonna keep it rear wheel drive. Yeah, rear wheel drive, there we go. I, I, I can't say stuff. Racing tank, dude, this already has like sports stuff. Dude, this is like a lot of horsepower. How much horsepower? Oh, I probably had like 400. 400 horsepower and 400 foot bounds of torque, so yeah, I'm just gonna go with that. I didn't even know this pet came out, guys, until I got home uh, like about an hour ago. Then I saw the uh, trailer because I was checking YouTube and I saw a trailer for this thing and I was like, wow, I need that. So I bought it and now I'm making a video for you guys. Wow, and uh, guys, let me know if you guys want me to do real life car reviews. Because I started this channel because I wanted to do eventually real or I wanted to do car videos, but Forza was all I could do because I didn't have any equipment or anything. And now I'm starting to get some equipment, and I kind of just want to do like real life stuff. Actually, I want to see what a roll cage is like. Oh shit, that is cool. That is cool. Yep, let's uh, let's go with that. 
Alright, uh, so yeah, I wanted to do real life stuff. So uh, let me know in the comments down below if I should stay doing Forza and just switch to real life. Or do Forza every once in a while. Kind of like that dude in blue makes a sad Kylo 4. I want to do like that dude in blue, He up David, he uploads stuff for games uh, kind of like once a month. I keep pressing B. Yeah, like once a month or just do full car reviews and not even do gaming anymore. So put that in the comments because if I'm going to do gaming, I might as well just get a, a uh, better capture card. But uh, yeah, put that in the comments down below what you guys want to see. And uh, I'll base my decision off of that. Alright, holy crap. 425s? What is it stock? 375s. And what was the front? That's 265s, 205s. Okay, so the front was normal. Arrow? Any arrow? Oh, yeah, we're putting that. We are putting that on. And that, that is sweet. Oh, this is a sweet, this, this is a, the best, like, one of the best cars in the game. So I'm going to tune this, guys, and I will see you guys back in Le Mans. You guys can download this tune by looking up my gamer tag, Shady Remains 7. And, uh, yeah. All right, so I'll see you guys when we get back to the track. All right, guys, we are back. And, uh... This thing looks mean with that spoiler and the front splitter. Wow. Alright, let's hear how it sounds. It just has so many pops and crackles, it's awesome. Alright, top speed, I'm thinking around 180. So let's go in three. Oh, wait a minute. I turned traction control on so I would get to experience this with you guys. So let's go in three, two, one, go. Alright, immediately off the line, wheel spin. In the second gear. In the third gear. In the fourth gear. Oh, oh, no, 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 no. No. Oh. I'm, I may be a bad driver. Fifth gear seems okay. I think we're good. Alright, come on. There's 165. 170. Come on, 172. Go. Look at the suspension working, that is sweet. This thing is like a death machine. Skulls and fire all over it, that is sweet. 173. It does have a sixth gear, but that didn't help us. Yeah, we just lost our speed. 173 is what it's gonna do. And you can't brake while steering, because ABS is off but uh yeah 173 from this death machine look how low to the ground this thing is hold on photo mode look how low this thing is scraping the ground no matter where it goes that is crazy but uh yeah if you guys enjoyed this video leave a like down below comment what you guys want us to next don't worry to subscribe for more content and i will see you guys in the next one see you on the track